Okay everyone, so in this uh, tutorial we're gonna learn how we can add a favicon right here to your website. So the favicon is this small icon that you see in the browser tab. So right now we have this uh, globe and we want to add our own favicon to brand our website. Alright, so to do this I'm gonna use Visual Studio Code but you can use any other code editor of your choice. So I'm going to go and open up my code editor. And first I'm just going to go and create a folder where I want to have my images and my favicon. So I'm going to right click right here in the left sidebar. I'm going to go and click on new folder. I'm going to name these two images. Just hit enter. That's it. Now we're going to go and get our favicon. So I'm using canva.com, but you can use whatever you like. So I'm just going to go and search for logo. Hit enter. And I'm going to go and create a blank logo. So because this icon is small, we're going to make it stand out as much as possible. So all I will do is just uh, choose one of these uh, logos. I'm just going to choose this one. I want to have this uh, background color. I'm just going to go and delete everything like so. I just want to have a W. All right. I'm just going to go and click on text. Choose add a heading. I'm just going to go and add a W. I'm going to make this as big as possible. Like so. So you can also just change the font if you like. So let's say I want to have this one. All right, so you can just play around until you have your favicon ready. After that, we're just gonna go and click on share and click on download. We're gonna download this as PNG and this is the size of 500 times 500. The preferred sizes for your favicon is 16 times 16 uh, pixels, 32 times 32 pixels, or 48 times 48 pixels. I'm just gonna go and download this. I'm just gonna name this to favicon. And I'm gonna go and click on save. Like that. Now we need to generate a favicon. So I'm gonna go and open up a new browser. I'm gonna go to Google. I'm just going to search for generate favicon, hit enter, and I'm just going to choose this one, favicon.io, uh, click on this one, PNG to ICO, and we're going to click right here, and we're going to choose our uh, image, click on open, and just click on download. Choose where you want to download it, like that. This will be a zip file. If you don't have a Mac and use a PC, uh, you need to download a zip uh, unpacker. So you can just go to Google, search for 7-zip. Just uh, go to this one, just download the right one and unpack this uh, favicon. All right, that's it. So we're gonna open up uh, this uh, favicon and we're gonna go into the folder and I'm gonna choose this one, favicon.ico. Uh, we're gonna go and drag it to the images uh, folder and release. So instead of using .png, we are using .ico because this is uh, supported by the most browsers uh, so I recommend you to use .ico, all right? And this has a size of 48 times 48, and that's fine. We're gonna use that. All right. Now we're gonna go to index.html. We're gonna go to the head tag. We're just gonna add the marker and make a new line. So now we're gonna link to this uh, favicon because. I use Visual Studio Code, I can use 
link and hit tab. Otherwise, just type this manually. So for REL, we're gonna delete style sheet and we're gonna replace this with icon, like so. After that, we have uh, type. So just type in uh, type equal within double quotes, we're gonna add image forward slash x dash icon like so and for href we're gonna link to this favicon so i'm just gonna add forward slash and now our drop down menu will appear so we're gonna click on images and choose favicon.ico and that's it just save everything go to the browser Okay, so now you can see that we have our favicon right here. We have the W with the yellow background, all right? So if you don't see uh, your favicon, that means you need to save your project. You need to clear some cache from your browser, try another browser or restart your computer. Otherwise, just check the code if everything is the same as mine. Okay everyone, so if this video helped you out, please subscribe for more of these videos. You can also check out my other videos right here. And if you need some help, you can go to the link in the description and join my Discord server. Have an awesome day, take care and bye.